Okay, guys. Shout out to Skybound Games. Mega Cat Studios for putting your girl Miss T in this game. I'm so excited to see myself. I'm excited to try this game. Trying out WrestleQuest for the first time. WrestleQuest is also available on Nintendo Switch, PC, on Steam, Xbox, and PlayStation. Y'all know that, okay? And if you didn't know, well, now you know. Appreciate it. I'm doing great today. How are you? Your birthday's tomorrow, too. Um, Q. HPK was good. Bank One, thank you for the follow. I truly appreciate it. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Let's try out this wrestle quest. Like, what's the word? Look at that. Miss Thickham's TTV. That's me. Let's check out the options. Just want to check this out. General. You can change the language English, Chinese, Brazilian. Uh, I'm guessing Dutch, Espanol, and fr uh, French for my Francie. Sound volume. Okay, this all looks good. So let me tell you guys real quick, because um, Travel Armless asked, WrestleQuest, a new game, came out this Tuesday. Um, yes, it was uh, delayed till this Tuesday. It was originally supposed to come out, I believe, on the 5th of August, if I'm not mistaken. Is it the 5th or the 8th? Got to go back and look at my calendar, but it did come out August 22nd, um, just this past week, right? And they had to delay it to perfect it. Um, they didn't want to put out a product that wasn't officially fully ready for everybody to enjoy. Um, so be sure to check out the game, guys, if you haven't or if you're a fan of wrestling, because some of your favorite wrestlers might be in the game already. As you can see, Macho Man, you see Andre the Giant and a few others right here, Jake the Snake, uh, Sergeant Slaughter. And some of your favorite creators are in this game. You're going to see me in the game. Bash World, um, I believe, Luge Mania, and a few others. And I see this map looks pretty huge. Yes, I, girl, this is my favorite piece to my closet. What did you call it? To the wintry winds of the Great North. Oh, Diamond Dallas Page. DDP's in the game too, chat. A macho man. Every toy lives, breathes, and craves wrestling, predicting their slams and paying homage to legends that came before them. That's Jeff Jerry. Oh, snap. They got Jeff Jerry. Many tales of creativity and imagination have sprung from the toy room, and many fabled battles have taken place here, both in and out of the ring. One such tale and its many battles, both of the plastic and of the heart, is about to begin. And a quest of this size takes not one hero, but two. Okay, let's see. Damn, this little cutscene is cute. I like this. Look at the, um, the people on the side, chat. Do you guys see him? The next match is set for one fall. From Columbus, Ohio, he's six foot two, two hundred and forty-seven pounds. The Macho Man. Yeah, it has an old school feel to it. Like, and personally, you know me, I love my retro games. So I am a killer for these type of uh, games. And I love this type of art. So Macho Man Randy Savage. And you can create yourself in the game chat. Ooh, yeah. We're here to see the cream rise to the top. So if you want to find me, don't look sideways. Don't look behind you. Just look up. No way, Macho Man, forfeit the match and give that championship belt to its rightful owner, me. Listen, Lizard, you got to earn this belt with your madness in the ring. It belongs only to the best. Yeah. That's why I'll be the champ for a long time. Dig it, 10,000 years as world champion. Ooh, yeah. Are those shades a little too dark? 
Can't you see I have this place rigged to blow? Explosives don't scare me. You stitched up cotton ball. You can't win by cheating. Oh, yeah, by the way, guys, um, a lot of, like, the moves and stuff in this game are, uh, like, think about, like, NBA Jam type of exaggerated. <laughs> and it's actually kind of cool. You always think you're such a hero, don't you, macho man? You can't win when the deck is stacked against you this bad. And that's the bottom thread because Stone Age said so. Can't win Stone Age. You are just a grain of sand in the desert of Macho Madness. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> Wow, wow, wow. Did you guys see that? Forget it, Randy. We'll never get tickets this late. Come on. We can still wrestle outside. Nice day. Go for it, Randy. Oof. Good thing this isn't the plastic mattress. Man, how do you, the pros do those high-flying moves without hurting each other? Are you kidding me? It's all fake, dude. What? Watch your mouth. Yeah, peanuts, shut it. You really think it's real? Really? Of course it's real. It's about as real as Todd. Hey. Counterfeit toys are still real. Shut up, Todd. And you, Randy, even if wrestling was real, which it isn't, you'll never be a pro. No kid from our town ever could be. Couldn't be more wrong. Wrestling is real. And I'll be its greatest champion ever. Okay, so I might have... Let me see, guys. Maybe you do play it as this guy. Let me check. Ah, yes. This new outfit feels espu estupendo. I guess that's what that means. Uh, but I better get one out of the main part of the gym. Mr. Stretch wants me to train the new students. The radar in the bottom corner will help you stay on course. Icons will appear here for the quest objective shops and healing. When in doubt, look here to keep slamming in the right direction. Okay, so maybe you play as this guy. Oh, okay, Chad, so. Oh, you can interact with this stuff. This is kind of cool. I don't think there's anything in that locker. Ah, uh, these lockers are empty. You know me, I like to check everything, chat. Hey, Casey, uh, my day's been good. How are you? Peanut's a hater. You got to destroy him. <laughs> Goofy, what's good? Everybody coming in here. Appreciate the love. We're trying WrestleQuest out for the first time. Okay, let's try. Like I said, I, w I just wanted to check. Can I check their bags? No, I can't. So you you could travel in this game too. This is my there you are, Randy. Get in the ring and show these greenhorns the ropes. You got it, Mr. Stretch. Oh my God, they're throwing me into a match. Oh shit! Oh shit! All right, rookies, you want to learn how to wrestle? You want to discover how big the crowd's loyalty and hear their cheers shake the very foundation of the universe? You want to be a coiled spring of excitement, the most electrifying thing the world of wrestling has ever seen 
man, this is downright poetic. Then you are in the right place, muchachos. Take some notes and soak it in. All right, guys, here we go. On your turn, you can strike taunt, use an item, or use a gimmick. Let's practice strikes first. Whenever you strike, you can earn some extra damage if you are able to match the button prompt. Try it now. Oh, C. Nice job. Oh, that's actually kind of easy. Most attacks have a chance to send your opponents to the ropes. Try it, amigo. Let's go. After knocking them into the ropes, you'll have a chance to follow the button. Okay. So you just gotta do it twice. All right, that's easy. Just do whatever it prompts you. Nicely done. Check your height meter down at the bottom. This is a measure of how pumped up the crowd is in your favor. You can ra raise the height meter by mixing up your attacks and nailing prompt buttons. Hype the crowd for extra damage and even to enable some powerful moves. One way you can build hype is by using the taunt option. This will generate hype equal to two plus your influence. All that grandstanding will leave you vulnerable though. And you'll take an extra 25% damage for one round. Try taunting now. <sighs> taunting is risky, but you can help, it can help build the hype quickly. Be aware though, if the hype meter dips in your enemy's favor, they'll gain an extra power instead. Oh shit! Oh shit! Thank you, EJ, for the congratulations. The trip was awesome, Hop. By the way, guys, at 9 p.m. Eastern, I'm gonna start TNR. Uh, what's up, Jay Ants? <laughs> I'm playing this on Xbox right now, but it is available on PC. Okay. Speaking of extra power, let's try out a gimmick. These are special abilities and wrestling moves. Oh, this is cool. Grab an enemy and show them a, some spice. Okay, let's try that one. Oh, the gimmicks are dope, chat. Oh, you gotta make sure you prompt, hit that prompt button though. Cause it goes by pretty quick. Such power, such strength, such machismo. I'll knock you out. Wow. Listen. What happens if you fail the prompt after knocking an en enemy into the ropes? Then the enemy will use that momentum against you. So you better nail it. Is the only way of beating an opponent is to make them lose all their HP? Dios mio, no. In fact, most other wrestlers you face will have to be pinned observe. Oh, so you also got to pin them too, not just bring their HP down. Or either or. See how this guy is weak and ready to drop? If we call this state, we call this state fatigue. You can fatigue an enemy by bringing them to low HP. Some abilities may also fatigue enemies as a debuff. Let's send him to the mat with a strike. Now this enemy is fallen. When your opponent is on the mat like this, he is ready to be put into a submission. The pin option will be available in the gimmick menu. So I'll be X, press X again, and then you can pin. Oh, it's actually really user friendly. I like this. To successfully pin them, you'll have to hit the button when the indicator is in the green zone. Careful, your opponent will get up and recover some health if you fail. 
Oh shit. Damn, if that's an interesting uh, pin meter. Nice, now the enemy is down and out. If you fail the pin prompt, your enemy will kick out and recover some HP. You can always pin to, you can always attempt to pin again after damaging him. Every pin attempt you will do gets easier. Be on your guard though. Enemy wrestlers can also pin you if you get too weak. And once you get pinned, there is no coming back. Also, note that not all enemies will need to be pinned. Only wrestlers and other tough guys. Damn, chat. I wonder if my wrestler needs to be pinned. <laughs> okay, so I got Randy Santos up. We upgraded him. Nice. That was actually really fun. Um, user friendly, by the way. Like I thought it was gonna be more difficult. And that covers the basics of wrestling. Strike and slam your opponent and be sure to hit those button prompts for extra damage. Beat them up and they'll be uh, they'll be softened up for a pin. Remember to keep things exciting and interesting to keep the crowd engaged so that you retain control over the hype meter. Thanks, Randy. Why don't you lend a hand with the other greenhorns around? When you're done, come see me in the AV room for some lessons with other advanced students. Press and hold um, B to run, okay. Oh, cool. I didn't know you could run in this game. Okay, cool, chat. So, in this game, you can like travel and talk and stuff. So right now I'm playing as Randy Santos. So I was mistaken. Uh, you know, you're, I haven't created myself or anything in this game. Uh, I'm playing as Randy Santos at the moment. So? What's with the ladder? Are they repairing something? The only thing they're fixing is the lack of spice in this matchup. Many battles include some extra schemes or rules. These themes amp up the challenge and the crowd. For a special match, attaining victory is a matter of playing by the rules for that match. So like a ladder match. They're in a ladder match, these two guys right here. Oh, look at that um, poster of DDP. This is like the weight room. What was this? Oh, that's so cool. Like you can interact with like little objects and stuff. What torso do I choose? Is it really all about the fringe? Fringe is important, but you can also consider the materials that the torso is made of. Each material reacts differently to the many types of elemental damage out there. If you know what element your enemy is going to use, you can prepare for it. I think I, there was something up here too to check out. Yeah, let's see. Can you be a woman in this game? Well, I'm, that's what I'm trying to find out. This is my first time actually playing the game, guys. Like, I am an NPC in the game, but I never played it until today. Like, I'm just coming back from a business trip. So I was so excited to give it a go. And this is like my first reaction, what you're watching right now. What's wrong with that guy? Did he drink a bad slam shake? I'm afraid not, amigo. He's suffering from a status effect. Many abilities add lingering effects that can help or harm you. Vain means you are particularly influenced by the crowd's behavior. You are less powerful when the crowd is negative towards you. The dreaded hype drain will curse Oh, excuse me will cause you to generate less hype with each action mint condition toys are super valuable well protected taking 50 percent less damage generate twice as much hype with each action when you are vibing burning units lose five percent of their hp every turn oh so there's like different effects chat in each fight there are many more status effects 
So be sure to stock up he on healing items or wear gear that protects you. Oh, uh, damn, this is actually kind of realistic. Thanks, Big Shaq. I really appreciate it. What it do, baby? Did you watch SmackDown yesterday? Because it was a tribute. Oh, yeah. I saw highlights of the tribute, Katie. It looked amazing. Yeah, it's, it's so sad. What? What do you guys think about the tribute? Who knew a gut buster would be so gut busting? Uh. Okay, I just want to... I like... I don't know about you guys, but like I like to interact with everything in these type of games. And I also like to... Um, like talk to everybody. Like it's just my style. I already spoke to that guy, and you see like little uh, posters and stuff of like some of your favorite legends. This is my domain. All right, who here knows the secret to pumping up the crowd? <laughs> I do. It's baby oil. Come on, Leonard. How many times do I have to tell you that baby oil is not the answer to everything? You know what? Get out of here. Go do some burpees until you puke. Sir, you can pump up the crowd by showing your spice in the ring. Very good, Randy. But what about before you get in the ring? I'll tell you. You've got to get on the mic and cut a promo so hot it will ignite the crowd and burn your opponent to ash. How do you do this? Part of it is knowing your enemy, and part of it is being fast on your feet. Time to try it, Randy. Come up here. Damn, guys, I already got to cut a promo. <laughs> this is crazy. Let's see how you do with a rapid fire session. Uh, let's see. Randy is, uh, he has a stupid name. Oh, damn, you got to cut promos in this, too. Randy is so weak. Even I can see that he doesn't stand a chance in winning. Oh, my God, you got to pick your promos quick in this one. You get, like, two options. I'm going to crack Candy Santos over here like a sugar cookie. Oh my god. And you gotta make sure you're picking the right one, chat. You see, class, you can generate hype before a big match by flexing on the mic. If you want to see more, I have an old match here on TV between the Luchador and Dash Talent back when the Luchador was still part of PAW. Prior to this bout, Dash has been antagonizing the Benefic Terror with a fishing rod during his matches against other opponents trying to hook him during a high flying move all right you slam junkies get back to work except for you randy i have a job for you what is it mr stretch there's a guy from the boxwood extreme wrestling the local wrestling league over at macho man statue you know it do i ever great this BEW wrestler needs help with his gimmick. You'll know him when you see him. He's kind of between styles. Face paint and handshakes. That's my first quest, chat. Sweet. <laughs> quest tracker. Check out the current objectives and past accomplishments in the quest tracker. This tool will provide a summary of your quest and provide directions on where to go next. Press RT to bring up the UI panel in this uh, in the overworld as a helpful reminder of what you should be doing. Go to the Macho Man statue east to meet a local wrestler in need of aid. Let me also make sure I save. Uh, let me see what you guys are saying in chat. Um, King Spirit Wolf, thank you for the bits. Appreciate the five biddies. Thank you so much for the congratulations and love, guys. Jason Viper, thank you. I appreciate the love on Instagram. Um, you said they executed it perfectly. It was two hours straight of crying. You haven't been online or tuned into SmackDown, not even knowing. And you were like, what the F? Yeah, it's so sad. 
Oh, that's so sad. Um, uh, travel. That's so sad. Okay. So you get your inventory in this game, guys. Like items. You get your skills. Let me take a look at my skills. My gimmicks right now. Prepare for a tag team. And then I got south of the border stunner. I need to get more of those. You got quests. So my quest right now is to go to the Macho Man statue. To the east to meet a local wrestler in need of aid. Okay, so let's see if I could get out of here. I think it's this way over here to get out of here. Will the public be able to get their hands on that 2K thing? That was the community day ring. Um big shack i don't know if it's gonna be on sale i want to say no but i can't confirm okay guys here's the world map i'm currently at the gym oh you could do different types of cameras i guess The Macho Man statue is right here. Hold up, but I want to see. Wh where else can I go? Okay, I guess I'm not there yet. I think that's where my character is at, chat. In this place over here. I don't know, honestly. I don't know where my girl was at. Known for his consummate physical ability. His savage wrestling style and his deep, graveling voice, Macho Man Randy Savage, is quite possibly the most iconic legend of wrestling. Celebrating 29 title reigns across his 32-year career, Macho Man was not just a celebrated champion, but a long-standing crowd favorite as well. Whether cutting exciting promos or delivering incredible and theoretical flying elbow drops, Randy Savage won fans and accolades everywhere he went. Even today, Savage is referred by fans and wrestlers alike with his story inspiring generation after generation. It is no secret that only someone like Macho Man can make the entire wrestling world stand up and say, Oh, yeah. Wow, what a beautiful statue. Oh, yeah. It's truly something, isn't it? Eh, I was always more of a fan of guys that wore face paint. Though that time Jake the Snake trapped Macho Man in the ropes and attacked him with a cobra would go over big in BEW. BEW? Wait, you're the guy I'm here to meet. I'm from the training gym. I'm here to help. Great. So you see, I can quite I can't quite decide which way to go. Should I be vibrant and electrifying or dark and brewing? Brooding. I think dark and brooding fits BEW better, but I just love using bright colors. I've got to pick something that will fit the vibe of the other guys or the writers won't know how to use me. Guys, real quick, I want to just say something real quick. This is for my people in FWW. Oh shit! Oh shit! I love this um, because it's so true. Your the way that a wrestler looks is so important. If you have a corny look or a corny gimmick, you're not gonna be booked. <laughs> like I wanna, I just wanna tell you guys, it's harder to book a wrestler that looks crazy out there and doesn't look appealing. You know what I mean? Like, if you got a corny attire, it's so hard to book you. <laughs> just want to make that clear to you guys. Writers. 
forget it look can you just go to the face paint shop for me they have some supplies i want to try out sure face paints so the writers will like you poor thing babbling about writers he must be delusional head to the face paint shop okay i gotta go to the face paint shop let me see you're not from around here randy savage is truly one of the best i hope i can be like him one someday Let's have a chat. Dude, check out that fringe. Macho Man sure knew how to dress. He's like the best parts of the 80s all rolled up into one. Haggis, leaps, and Even in Calgary, we honor the Macho Man, a Macho King's exceptional slamming chivalry. Okay, let me keep it moving. This is actually so cool, guys. Look at that Macho Man statue. My daughter asked me to bring her here, then told me not to stand by her. Guess I'm not cool enough. Oh, well, maybe I can check out that face paint shop when we're done. Is there a neon black? Is there neon black or a moody pink? Those would be perfect. I came all the way from Omakamachi to check out this shrine. Oh yeah. Damn, we got some big Macho Man fans in the in here. Macho Man was amazing. By the way, I, guys, I love Macho Man and WCW. Let me know, I guess, your favorite Macho Man match or time. Uh, anything to do with Macho Man. Oh, and the Slim Jim commercials. I liked him there too. Hola amigos. Hmm, strange. There's nobody here. Maybe they're in the back. Face paint or on your feet? What kind of madman will do such a thing? Oh, I see some. Look, guys, there's a trail of face painting. Green face paint. There's a uh, green face paint, like uh, footprints. And it's leading to the back. Hello. Take it all. Gather the war paint for our overlords. <gasps> They're stealing. They're looting the shop. Here's one. Take him alive. And we'll melt him down to use his plastic as war paint. Oh, hell no. <laughs> Yeah, you bugging, bro. Oh my gosh. See, I missed that first prompt, chat. Yes, I got him. I'm gonna keep striking him. Oh my God, I almost missed that again. Dude, that prompt goes so fast. You gotta be on your toes. You gotta be on your toes. Let me pin him. All right, here we go. Yes, I did it. <laughs> My first victory in WrestleQuest. Whee! Let's go. Nice, nice shot. Okay, let me show you guys. I'm actually gonna move myself right here real quick. Okay, so victory, 130 points. I got my duct tape. I'm on the way to the next level. Silence, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the stream. I'm trying out WrestleQuest for the first time. You like the Slim Jim commercials? Me too. Macho Man versus Spider-Man? You can't with my... Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, uh, King Spirit Wolf. I should find the shop owner before these wasteland slammers try to melt him down too. 
Damn, look at that, guys. There's some, like, footprints. But let me... Wait, is this a... <gasps> I found a treasure chest, an elbow pad. Nice. I gotta learn how to equip my stuff. Oh, wait, I think I saw it in the menu. Wrestlepedia? Let me see what's that. Oh, the Wrestle Raider is on my Wrestlepedia. Wandering the waste for, uh, for face paint and baby oil. These mad action figures worship the Road Warriors, Animal, and Hawk. Dude, this is so cool. I love that this game is surrounded by wrestling. Well, let me make sure I save. Make sure you always save, guys. And you get achievements here, too. I don't know what karma is yet. Quest. We're currently doing this quest right now in the paint shop. My team. I don't think we're there yet. Skills. Inventory. Equipment. Okay, let's see. Accessory. I'm gonna put in my elbow pad as my accessory because I just unlocked it. I don't have um, anything around my waist yet. You gotta get equipment as you go in the game. I equipped it the elbow pad. Now I'm like the people's champ, the one and only one, the great one. You should know your role and shut your mouth! Now that I got my own elbow pad, it's a wrap. I'm liking this game so far. It, it really is revolved around the world of wrestling. And, and it's so nice. What's up, Matt? I see it's your first time in my channel. Welcome to the stream. And the gameplay is easier than I thought. Okay, so personally, I was a little intimidated. I was like, I'm like not sure. Is it going to be more challenging? But the gameplay is, is fun and easy like the matches. Oh, I found another treasure chest. Action figure speedos. Is that the um, belt that I needed? Yes. Okay, I equipped it. Nice. Oh, I got my first achievement. Nice. <laughs> okay, nice. Okay, I see more stuff over here. Table spot token. I wonder what that is. Let me see. Inventory items. Used for breaking through a table spot lock. Uh, I guess I gotta use that for something. Okay. All right. Oh, so that's what I need that for, to break through that table. A table, there's only one way uh, uh, there's only one way through one of these. A table lock blocks your path. Unlock the table with a table spot token. Once you find one, reapproach the table to throw a wrestler through it. Table locks and table spot tokens come in three varieties single, double, and flaming, with each table corresponding the appropriate token. Oh. Wow, I got through the door because I broke it with the, the table token. More war paint. Our masters demand it. Somebody help. We're being robbed. Oh, my God. I got to go help this guy. Okay, guys. I got to help. Okay, nice. I got him. I gotta also cut my. I gotta do my gimmicks too if I feel like it's not taking up enough HP. Oh nah, I'm I'm gonna take him down. Oh snap! I missed that second one. Not even gonna lie to you. I gotta pin him. Damn, wait, wait. Alright, here we go. We're gonna pin him. <gasps> no! You gotta really, like... The thing is, like, you really gotta make sure you don't miss that pin. Because if you miss that pin...
Oh yeah, I gotta knock him out. Yeah. If you miss that pin, you gotta redo it. Okay, let's try it. Here we go. Okay, guys. I gotta make sure I do it on point. Yes, okay, that time I got it, but I missed it the second time and they made me like redo it and your enemy gets a little bit of HP if you like mess up the pin. Yeah, I'm definitely not scared tonight. You're right. Uh, Molly World, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the stream. I'm trying out WrestleQuest for the first time. Buddy, that was amazing. Are you a superhero? Ha. Superheroes are fake. I'm a pro wrestler. Well, whatever you are, those were some macho moves, muchacho. Yes. Macho moves, muchacho. I like the sound of that. Those blasted wrestler raise wrestle raiders come down here to get supplies for the rituals to worship the road warriors hawk and animal i wish they could emulate someone more heroic someone more heroic anyways what can i do for you bud it's on the house amigo i'm here for a special order some samples for an hombre going through an identity crisis ah i know the one can't decide between goth and surfer here they are thanks muchacho okay now i gotta return back let me see maybe i can talk to him one more time good luck with that goth surfer guy and thanks again for the heroics macho muchacho okay The way the ref comes in the ring is crazy. Yeah. It's actually kind of lit. All right, let me uh go back. What's cool too is that you travel. Hello. We carry the best um in face makeup here, but it doesn't look like your gimmick needs any. And I got a nice little shop here. It's kind of cool. Okay, now we got to travel back. Gotta go back to the Macho Man statue. Here, I hope these help in your quest at BEW. Thanks. Say, what do you think I should choose? Go with the surfer style. You stand out more. It suits a true hero. Go goth, amigo. You'll be more intimidating and mysterious. Fans will love it. I'm gonna tell him to go goth. It looks like more of his style. Thanks. I'll consider that. If you need me, I'll be over here practicing some catchphrases. Go see Johnny Stretch back at the gym. Okay, I gotta go back to the training gym. Okay, so here we go. Back to the training gym. Hey, Randy. How'd that job go? I appreciate you doing it. It should strengthen our gym's relationship with BEW. It was unexpectedly enlightening, sir. Yeah, Boxwood Extreme Wrestling is a trip. They really push for an intense vibe. What with all the barbed wire and edgy characters and all. But it's what you got to do if you want to compete with the top dogs like PAW, Plush, and Action Figure Wrestling. I met enlightening about myself, sir. Great. It's always good to learn more about ourselves and strive to become better. That's enough for one day. Are you closing up again tonight? You bet, sir. Thanks, Randy. It's dedication like that that will take you far. Sweet, guys. I completed my first quest. <laughs> please help Mr. Stretch's new students. And please help that poor BEW wrestler regain his senses. Amen. What a great day, macho man. I feel like I learned so much. Oh, he's talking to the poster, I think, chat. I'm convinced now more than ever that we must always live our, out our wrestling spirit. And that the world needs more heroes. Good night, Macho Man Randy Savage. Macho Muchacho. Hello. 
You're here already? The sun hasn't even put the moon down for a three count yet. Always good to get an early start, sir. Is that a sleeping bag coming out of your locker? Doesn't matter. Listen, I've got a surprise for everyone. Head over to the ring when you're ready. Okay, guys. I'm going to save right here because we need to do a TNR. But let me tell you... I'm really enjoying this game so far. I love that you can travel and also the game is so revolved around pro wrestling. Like everything is pro wrestling. Um, the Macho Man statue was so cool. I cannot wait to run into myself in this game. This looks so freaking cool. Like, oh my God, it's amazing. Yeah, the game is so cool. What's up, Slime? How are you? So you play as Randy Santos, at least so far. I honestly thought, like, maybe you create yourself, but I don't know. Right now, I'm playing as Randy Santos. I like it so far, though. It's pretty cool. Your uncle had a Mania 5 tape, so your favorite moment was the Mega Powers exploding, Savage versus Hogan. This is so freaking cool. The time he thought Hogan wanted Miss Elizabeth on Saturday night main event and beat up Hogan backstage, breaking up the mega powers. <laughs> yeah, it's so crazy. Ma Macho Man has so many good moments, but I loved him in WCW chat, and I love those damn Slim Jim commercials. Those were my favorite. So, yeah, Sparta, this is the game that I'm in as an NPC. Um, I showed you guys this game a few, I want to say a few weeks ago. I'm telling you though, it's, this is a lot of fun. I should have taken, let me take a screenshot in front of that. Um, can I go back out, out into the world? Let me try it. Yeah, you could. I want to take a screenshot right there um, at the Randy Savage uh, statue. This is so freaking cool. Do I like how 2K is looking so far? Yeah, I do. Travel, that's what I'm trying to figure out right now. Like, it, it seems to me like we're at the training gym and this is where we start off in the game. And, you know, you're helping out in the training gym, exploring throughout the game. There's a lot to interact with. There's quests. There's so much to do. Um, and it's pretty cool. All right, we're going to leave it right there, though, chat. I did say. Sent me a box. I want to show you guys what the box looks like. Um, a shout-out to uh, Mega Cat Studios and also shout-out to um, Skybound Games. Well, show you guys. This is the box. This is the box with... Um, you know, the cover art, Macho Man, you see Hawk and Animal, Andre the Giant. Um, you see a, a little bit of everybody, the Skybound games right there on the side. Also not trying to, you know, give you guys my address. <laughs> so Quest. And this is, again, the outside of the box. They sent me a few goodies. This is the WrestleQuest card, and they wrote some kind words in the back. And I love that this is, like, handwritten because it really shows that they took the time for each of their creators and people that, you know, um, were put into the game. So it was super cool that it, it was handwritten. They're just saying thank you uh, for being a part of the journey and a part of the game. And, you know, they were looking forward to launch. They sent me a couple things in this box. Uh, this WQ for WrestleQuest, if I want to set my drink. Um, 
they also sent in here uh wrestle uh, wrestling matches okay so you know wrestle wrestling matches you're a part of them but i actually got some um wrestling matches in here <laughs> and when you open it it's actually not the wrestling matches you know it's actual like matches yeah so we got some matches in here they also sent me this like little wrestle quest uh, water bottle and they have a cinnamon power bomb for me so this cinnamon power bomb <laughs> the cinnamon power bomb is a candle mm, it smells so good it smells like straight up cinnamon oh my god it smells so yummy <laughs> smells literally like good as cinnamon <laughs> okay <laughs> they also have in here this one is sweaty betty's muscle uh shine so I, it's like baby oil because as you saw in the game the dude says the best way to get you know get the crowd on your side is by putting some baby oil on your chest um I might have to try that. <laughs> I, I might have to try that one. I'm not sure. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. But, yeah, they got the little, like, baby oil. Also, um, I got these Wrestle Quest. Hold on. Let me see. Can I open it or make it bigger? Is this supposed to be, like, elbow pads or, like wrist pads let me see is it a headband i think i could put them around my wrist okay let's try it i gotta do it over here <laughs> rub some baby oil on my forehead yeah that will definitely win the crowd over oh these are like wrist uh, like wristbands guys I got two of them so they sent me like these wristbands that say wrestle quest on them <laughs> so I think this is super cool I can see myself using this maybe in October when I cosplay as because they also sent me macho man's glasses <laughs> try these on i still haven't tried them let me put this whole outfit on for you guys real quick okay i feel like i should like maybe put his music on chat let me see <laughs> okay let's try it let me go on youtube let's see if i can find his song macho man this is gonna be so hilarious randy savage theme <laughs> <laughs> Look at it, chat. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. These are actually so freaking cool. <laughs>